Yeah, that's kind of a spoiler right there. Yeah. But anyway, after I logged off, and I was also kind of salty a little bit, but I never, like, blocked the kid or anything. He's still on the friends list. Yes, he made you go, boy. Hey, Joe go, boy. If you're watching this, you're in for a real treat. But, what happened is someone, his name is Rudy. Wait, he has Rudy in his name. He invited me to a party. And as soon as I got in there and I said, hello, someone immediately said, this kid is transgender. Which, like, I'm not. Like, bruh. Yeah, I'm oh, sorry to do something, but... And me, I was like, oh my god, this is gonna be a long ride. And I was like, no, I'm not. And everyone was like, well, at least you're, like, well, you're a guy, and I'm literally not. Like, I know it sounds like it, but once I get to 50 subscribers, I'm doing a face reveal. So y'all gonna see that I am indeed a lady. Anyway, let's get back to the story. I just left because they were screaming. What are we screaming in their mics? And I couldn't handle it. I was like, okay, bye. And then I kept getting invited. And then they said in the chat, in the chats that, let me go check it. This has been a long time and I cannot remember. But I was like, bruh, I'm not trans and I'm not a guy. And then he called me the F word, not the F U C K, but the other one, F A G. You know what I'm talking about, probably. But, like, yeah. Then, my friend Rudy literally was like Cho Poppy and stuff in the mic. And. I just wanted to leave, but I just didn't because I wanted to that I was a girl because it's annoying how my voice doesn't sound like girl and yeah so I stayed there and I actually made a pretty good point I said what's wrong with being gay which seriously what is wrong with being gay I have a f I think she was my cousin I don't know I have a bunch of family But she's bisexual. But what would be wrong with being gay? Like, I bet as a, everyone, as a kid, would be like, but aren't boys and girls supposed to be there? Because I was. And, yeah, I guess it's kind of weird for them when they're starting. And, like, the dude, the Rudy guy, what do we sound like he was, like, seven? Like, I don't know if he'd be watching, but seriously, dude. So we were kind of arguing, and then they left, and then this dude hit, you know the YouTuber Tommy in it, the mom of my adopted kid? Yeah, there was a guy with that name, and he was like, well, I guess his name was Ryan, and he was like, please shut the F up, and I was like, yeah, you got the point. So I cracked a joke or two about them having wild mics. And then I just added the guy because I thought it was kind of a chill dude. And then he invites me to a party. And I'm like, okay, I guess I'll join. There's a girl, she has like, Savior or something in her name. And she was like, uh, yeah, hi, why'd you add my boyfriend? And I didn't hear the first time. I thought she, I thought I misheard her, so I just kind of stayed silent. I was like... Uh, and then the Tommy guy was like, are you not in here? And the girl was actually had an Australian accent. She was like, are you, why did you add him? I was like, I don't know. We have the same opinion. Why did you add my boyfriend? And I and I'm totally cool with her being kind of an overprotective girlfriend. Like as long as you're not a control freak, I don't see 
too much wrong with that. Like, uh, sometimes can be a little bit paranoid. And it's like, girl, I'm 11. And she's like, and? And I did not want to get into this. Yeah, she sounded like she was an, an adult, so I just left. And then, but I still wanted to prove my point to the both the Slayers. Yes, I have a Slayer in the name. So I found out how to send pictures from your phone and tablet and computer and stuff. And you really shouldn't do this on the internet. But, yeah. It's enough fun of myself. The Rudy guy, which was actually on my side, he was saying... Before this, he was saying a bunch of weird stuff. Like, I'm not even gonna say what my guy was saying. Wait, there's a level 17. Ooh. But he was saying how he wanted to F. That's all I'm gonna say. But he just comp- And he actually believed I was a girl. He completely switched sides. Well, he still believed I was a girl, obviously, since I sent a freaking photo. But he was like, I want to bleach my eyes out. Which, I don't know why. Like, but you can keep your opinions to yourself. Just say, oh. But this guy had to be rude AF. And he called me an H-O-A-R. And I was like, bruh, I wasn't even trying to hit on you. I'm 11. And this kid's mic, I could not understand. Oh, I could barely understand a word he was saying. He sent another message. Yeah, I, I couldn't understand what he's saying. But this was insane, and this happened over the course of an hour, which was pretty crazy. And this happened after I kept getting sniped. I. I'm getting sniped to be in a huge situation asking why I'm asking if I'm trans is kind of a crazy twist and yeah also I would be recording this in Apex but yeah, if you enjoyed this then smash that like button I know I haven't done a story time like this in a few months I can check when's the last time I did this Of course, I have Nyan Cat e Ray from my freaking search history. Let me see. It's been a while. Two months ago. So, yeah, if you want to see more in the Fortnite Kids series, the Fortnite Teens, whatever, smash that like. Um. If we get to one like, one like, that'll be good. I don't care who it's from. It can be from Joe Biden. It can be from some kid just sitting in the dark binging YouTube. It's alright. But I'll try and do more of these. I like telling stories. Because it's kind of weird to talk about Fortnite with my grandma. And yeah. I don't know how to end this.